It is a Group 3 doubleheader coming up uh, for the first twilight meeting of the season this Sunday at Sha Tin. We've got uh, 11 races on the programme. Tom, uh, who is it you would like the viewers to follow? Race number four, Renika, son of Vancouver, who's only had one start for a John Size. It's a Grand Nova, just a three-year-old. Now we've got Chick coming off the back straight. Settled back shortly after the start and was more of sort of a, a concertina effect in that uh, a little Chick off the back straight. And as he was starting to make ground here over the late stages of the race, just to ran out of room and Hugh Bowman had to uh, take a hold of him. So uh, that was over a 1,000 metres to the bigger track, Shartan. More roomier space here. Barrier number seven, I thought he could uh, come up maybe some each way. Uh, Grand Nova in race number four. Yeah, it was typical. Happy Valley stuff that last time, wasn't it? Um, I'm going with a horse uh, by the name of Steps Ahead in race number seven. I, I think it's certainly worth following. This horse, uh, who's run a really good race on debut, that's him highlighted in the yellow and red colours. Francis Loy, uh, he is aiming for a trainer's championship, so he's unleashing uh, another very nice young horse here. He's kept on really well behind uh, a horse that will reoppose. He's better off at the weights with Heyday. Low pan spirit behind him in third. I've got plenty of time for the fifth horse. Straff Peffer has won since, and uh, his form looks pretty solid. Draws gate number one, and I think he can uh, go one place better this time in. So steps ahead uh, to take that step forward uh, and get that win. Grand Nova coming up for Tom uh, in race at number four. First race uh, due to jump uh, on Sunday. It's a twilight meeting due off at 4 p.m.